Hello and welcome back to Yogcraft. Today the whole crew is here working on the, the B base. Um, Simon's got a power suit. As you can see, it's a little bit glitchy. It's actually a brown colour. But if I look at Duncan, he's just um, like... It's orange. Uh, <laughs> it's orange. It's not brown. It's already soiled it. It's sort it of does look brown. flashing. Yeah. It's a bit weird, yeah. How have you got it so dirty already before we even started? <laughs> I was excited. Looks like a really trashy tunic. Uh, That's right. So Simon's back from his holiday uh, Woo. in the Caribbean. Woo. How was it? Uh, it's actually pronounced uh, the Caribbean. Oh, I didn't know that. Um, and it was lovely. I had a magical, wonderful time. Um, there was a cocktail bar actually inside of a pool. Wow. Um, but unfortunately, I went to charge my phone there, and I basically shorted out the entire hotel oh, no. uh, for the whole time I was there. Oh. Um, oh. Well, good. You also got a cold. But yeah, that's good. So, um, Sips and Shin, hey, yeah. here, how you doing? Hello. Doing good. Bit of sting people with bees. You got your bunny slippers. Yeah. <laughs> and my tropical queen armed. Oh. Have we go. got any more pieces of armor for them yet, Duncan? So they can actually see yeah, at night. Yeah, I made them some, made them some amazing um, pink hats. Oh, nice. Yeah, man. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, <laughs> oh let's thanks. have a look at those. Oh, I got two. You got my head. Nice. Just going to have two. No, I, I need that. Oops. <laughs> it's an alley -oop. I need that helmet. Where is it? <laughs> that was <laughs> such a gone? long throw. So, <laughs> From downtown. Oh, here is. I got it. Oh, I got it. There you, go. there you go. Oh. Um, it's a shame they're invisible, actually. I'm in the wrong game mode. Oh, yeah. So, in order to, in order to save um, hassle, we're going to um, split up into pairs, otherwise it's going to be crazy. So, uh, I think Shin and Duncan are going to work on the... S securing a power supply because we, we the solar panels went missing and I, I realised it was because we'd somehow removed them from the mod yeah. so I don't know whether Ridge did it in order to make us a bit give us a bit more of a challenge but there's plenty of fuel sources we can use for power anyway we've got oil over there we've got lava over on the volcano so figure something out go get some power and then work on whatever you want to work on me and Sips and Simon are going to try and get hold of this rare wood and, and the bees and stuff and I've set a little bit of bee bee piping up so a bee machine so oh, I'll show yeah. you bees again. That here you go, Simon. Here, look. You can have this one. Where over here? Have you have you made a joke about if we upload this to YouTube, is it a bee movie? Have you made that joke yet? No, oh. no, that's all yours. Okay. Well, don't, because it's really bad. Um, uh, don't even bother. <laughs> oh. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So anyway, this is the bee machine. But basically, what I've got Ooh. here is a is a this is this is how Ooh. I've got the whole the whole orchard set up. To, to sort of um, grow the crossbreed the trees. So I've got a beehive here with a bee in it. Oh, beehive! And <laughs> we, we have these, that these pipes oh. effectively <laughs> will continually suck out the, the, the products from the beehive, but also put in new queens and new drones. So it, it constantly refills them with new ones. Gotcha. Um, cool. Oh, wow. So if I, if I turn on this, this pipe here, it'll, it'll pipe out um, any... Bees. Any, any bees that have come back around and they'll go through all the pipes. No. Oh. oh, look at all these bees. What does it do with those those poor bees? Well, I mean, they're, they're, they're treated... You can see them coming out of this thing, look. They're treated gently. They look sad. So, but yeah. where do they go? Into these flowers. They go into the beehive, into the bottom. So drones have to be piped into the bottom and princesses have to be piped into the top. And these Billcraft pipes will actually fill an empty slot in the item, in this case the apiary, if they're set up like this, um, right. like right next to them, if you if you have the pipes not like this, sometimes they'll pop off, and then you end up with big piles of bees all over the place, and you don't want oh, that. Oh no, that would be awful. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> but yeah, so this is how I've actually got it set up over in the orchard um, over here, and I've actually got oh. all of these apiaries that I had last time um, set up individually with bees going around. And the, the idea of these bees is simply to make a bit of basic honey, a bit of basic beeswax. These ones are blue. Yeah, so it looks like they've actually gone up a few levels. These are cultivated ones. So they've been going around quite a few times. So they've levelled up. Yep. And as you can see, they've <laughs> turned these leaves here on this tree to a different colour. So if we graft these leaves off, we should be able to get some new trees. So I'll show Simon how to do that in a minute. Um, uh -huh. And we'll, 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 do some, we'll do some tree work. 
Right, anyway, off to you two go. Go and do your own stuff. All right. Duncan. Yay. We'll see you Get the hell out of here. Later. You jerks. We'll see you in a bit. Thanks for the armor, Duncan. Cheers, man. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I'll let you figure out how to use can it Can we yourself. put some golden transport pipes on these bee pipes so that the bees can go faster? I think they would like that. I think they w- they feel the need for speed. Yeah, I mean, we can do that, Sips, but it doesn't actually work with bees. Oh. The gold transport pipes don't actually transport bees any faster. You need to use apiarist pipes, which are the special bee pipes, and you make oh, those okay. using uh, a diamond <laughs> pipe bad. plus uh, a thing called propolis, which you get from bees. It's like a product. So let me just show you. Does it whip them through the pipe at high speeds? It does, yeah, actually. Oh, man, that's so If you good. come down the big hole... I beg your pardon? Do you want, I'll just quickly show you this. So this is the is big... This, is this some sort of trick? No. No, that's that's not actually the big hole. Okay. Um, careful. It's the other There's hole, which is the big, big hole. hole. This, this hole. So come down here. Where did he go? Where'd you go? Oh. Down oh, there this he hole. Is. He's, he's down Sorry. the same hole he just said wasn't the big hole. Oh no! Yeah, he is. Yeah. Oh hey. yeah, it is there pretty much are. the same place, isn't it? It's the same hole. So I hollowed out this sort of cave system and also dug it out a bit. And as you can see, above is all the beehives. Okay, above yeah. us here are pipes going around, taking the, the. So there's a bit of honey there coming from one of the beehives now, and that will come oh, yeah. around eventually, slowly. So there's a few more God. bees seen coming along here. Right. And that's going to take forever. They eventually get down to this. Um, B pipe here, which I've only made one because they're really expensive, um, but I didn't have enough propolis either because sometimes that's a little bit harder to come by. You have to get it from centrifuging these honeycombs. So this B pipe will actually speed up the bees and oh, throw yeah. them back Ooh. into the system. Oh, yeah, it like whips those honeycombs right into the crystal. That's cool. Look at this thing. So this is the crystal Jeez. chest here full of the, the sort of bee loot. Okay. Um, <laughs> and in here we've got honeycombs, dripping honeycombs, a bit of rocky comb and stringy comb. Oh. So each bee will make something different. And you can obviously spend a long time breeding the bees together. And eventually the idea is that we'll get a bee that makes coffee and a bee that makes chocolate. What? And we'll be able to use those in the Jaffa factory. Uh, I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> um, These are yeah. quite odd bees, I must admit. They're quite strange. But but you can see how it would work in nature. Like a bee might might bake honey out what of about, a chocolate plant. What about steak? Or a does steak bean? come from a bee? Yeah, steak, I think, is does, one of the yeah. things which doesn't come from bees, no. Um, in fact, it's when you cut their butts off, it's full, it's steaky, and you just charbroil, it's good. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. Bee rump. Bee rump. So, um, in me. here are all the bees that aren't going back into the system. Oh, so, my, God. oh my God. So these are, the, these these are the excess, the excess <laughs> bees. <laughs> And we will have a use for these. Bees. these they're discarded bees. They're no. excess bees. We'll have a use for them. Don't worry. Eat, um, oh. eat some of them, Simon. Just ch- look at these ones. Are rocky drones. They're, they're dead. Look at them. They're they're all grey. You can eat Should those try and eat a bee. Oh, now that don't try and eat a bee. Jesus Christ! You, you you have to put it in a pasty before you eat it. Eat it. You have to, um, a bee pasty. Yeah, we had this discussion before. So I'm eating one. As you can see, ah, so there you go. There is actually a, a quite advanced bee in here. So there's there's the bee. This bee pipe that I've got set up here is only sending certain bees back into the system. Oh, okay. okay, it's only sending cultivated drones back and and all queens, all princesses. Sorry. So any any princesses that get produced by the bees will go back in, but it's only sending cultivated bees back. And the idea of that is that hopefully it will upgrade the bees that are above um if it'll breed in you know a higher level of bee but there is a chance that bees will get like this for example this is an unweary drone now this is quite a good one this green one because it's it's like oh. quite a higher tier and i obviously need to analyze it and see what it's what its genetic code is but hey watch the, the bee go through look at this it's a more advanced <laughs> one <laughs> look at <them> go. <laughs> so, sorry so so basically i can I can then put the unweary one here. Let's see. Um, unweary. So now, I, if I know that unweary drones are being made in the system, I've now set this bee pipe up. So actually, that's that's wrong. How do you extract DNA from a from a bee? These poor segregated bees. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. So basically, um, eventually, I'm going to build a genetic bee laboratory, which I can use these. I can get bees, and I can I can basically mess with the DNA of bees and make the ultimate bee. You're playing God! <laughs> you got mad! Super B. Don't worry, we'll get to that in ages, because that will take ages. Okay. First things oh. first, trees. So come back out. Trees and bees. 
I want to see the big B though. Can we can we just like hurry that up so I can see it ne- like right now? I, I can't wait. The Oxford B isn't going to be a big B. <laughs> it's not going to be like a B. giant B. Like them. Well, it's it just a giant B. <laughs> it should be a massive uh, B, yeah. So head back through to the Jaffa factory. Is this, have we done it right? I think so, yeah. Okay, This. so this is this is the MLG team. MLG this is, team. This is pro. What are we doing? <laughs> uh, we, uh, power? <laughs> power. We need, Oh, I don't. I don't know what to do. I've always used solar. Are we supposed to be using like natural power? I guess so. Why don't we use solar? Because it's not working anymore. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, oh, yeah. There's some oil here. What about that? That's a bit kind of grotty, isn't it? Because we'll is. have to turn it into fuel and stuff. Mm. There's cool stuff in forestry though that we can use as buildcraft power. There's a volcano. Can we make some geothermals? Oh, where's that? In the jungle, it's a big one. Oh, a jungle volcano. Yeah, we could do. It's a good idea. It's quite a big... Oh, it's a nice one, actually. It's a bit of grass. Should that be there? I don't think that should be there. <laughs> what? Where? I'll, I'll get rid of it. It's gone. Oh, it's stopping the lava. That's why it's there. Ah! ah. <laughs> I see now. Oh, this flight control's <laughs> weird. I can't get used to it. How do you go up? Uh, you have to look in the direction you want to go. It doesn't take me up if I go up, if I look up, though. It's because you're only using jet boots and not jet pack. It's kind oh. of, like, semi-good. Uh, <laughs> so I'm gimped, basically. Yeah. I just have to go up very slow. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So, I wonder how much lava is actually down here. How do we check? Probably not a lot. I mean, these things typically just are a shaft of lava. There'll be lava sources all the way down to the bottom. Right. But the bottom might have, like, a small sphere. Probably not much. If I, It's probably best piping from the nether, but that's even harder, isn't it? Oh. <sighs> There might, you never know. There might be like a big pool down there. Should we should we just suck from the volcano and, and trust that there's a lot of lava down there? Yeah, let's let's get it into a big tank. Yeah. I guess we should make like a base first, though, like a power plant. Oh yeah, like a power building. Um, let's see. What have I got with me? I've got some chiselled sandstone and some chiselled stone. I've only got cobblestone. <laughs> oh, well, I guess that'll do. Yeah. Um, I, I'll ch- chuck you some blocks of this. We could have a cobblestone floor. How how, how hard is it to mine this stuff? This stuff is is pretty easy with that. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it turns into, like, this weird crap basalt cobblestone. Oh. You can make basalt brick, though. That's really cool. Can you smelt it? I think you've got to smelt it to make it into this stuff. Or make it into brick. Yeah, that's true. So, how do you want this to look? What was our inspiration here? I don't know. I mean, ooh. Should we set this lava going? I think we should. Yeah, it's a good idea, actually. Let's dig some trails out for it to kind of run down. Yeah. Do we want to stop before the jungle? Nah, that's great. <laughs> it's just set fire to the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, this is going to run all the way down. Uh-oh. So, oh, I don't really know what I'm kind of building, though. What, what's it need to look like? Uh, just like a shed or um, a drill? A shed. Uh, maybe not a shed, because wood is kind of... Um, Flammable. What about like a big water tower but full of lava? That'd be a cool idea. Yeah, yeah, like a kind of like a yeah. Where are we going to put the actual engines though? Uh, engines. Yeah, for the actual magma um, turning it into power. Oh, what do we? Hen- what how do we turn it into power? We need like a a a, a, a magma a f- mag. There's a mag- ma- magmatic engine. I think it is. Yeah, yeah, mag- yeah. Magmatic engine. You sure? Isn't, yeah. Isn't there like a, a something else we needed, like a, a bread something? A bread? A v- energy conduit, I think. Oh, well, we, we could use that to send it back over there power-wise, or we could just pipe it through pipes. Pipes probably have a big decay, though, don't they? What's, what is an energy conduit? What does it do? Energy conduit. Conduit. I think... Oh, yeah, yeah, that, that's just, um, energy conduit's just like a, a wire, isn't it? Like a redstone, like a pipe wire. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, Let's just get some lava okay. and store it, f- step one. Okay, step <laughs> step one. So, do we use a pump? Yeah, let's just, I'm going to look up a picture of uh, something, like a water tower or something. Okay, cool. You might have noticed that with your power suit boots, Ooh. you can actually just walk up one block high... Uh, blocks without any issue, oh, like stairs, so you don't have okay. to jump up individual one block high things. That's useful to know. Now, Simon, grab a grafter from in here. 
uh, or actually several because they don't last very a long. Grafter. Yeah. Oh, right. So grab a grafter, and what you want to do is you want to hit out the blocks that are coloured on these trees. So here's a block here. It's a bit racist. On this tree, which is a different colour, and this means it's been pollinated by a bee, and it will make a crossbreeded. So you mean the leaf? Yeah, the leaf block. Yeah. Sorry. What did I say? Come on. Come on, Simon, okay, do it. So Hit break it. it. Oh, yeah. And you should get a sapling. Every time you break one, you'll get a sapling. A silver birch sapling. Okay, that doesn't sound like a crossbred, very good tree. So see if you can break some of these other ones on these other trees. Oh, look, Simon, there's a whole bunch over here. Look. Oh, my um, God, there's tons. And what we're looking for is we're looking for quite... Oh, looking, this is pink. A different one. A hill cherry sapling. Wow, okay. Oh, man. That is perfect. That's, That's what one. we need. That's like plus 7,000 agility from my Magic the Gathering cards. You need to grab a whole <laughs> bunch of these saplings. Right. And see what you get. Um, so get, get, get as many as you can. And then once you've got as many as you can, cut down all of the trees in this whole place and replant them with the crossbred saplings. Wow. Um, right. Okay. <laughs> so and not you've got much, five minutes then. to do it, so so hop to it, <laughs> son of a bitch. Well, it will take you literally no time at all, because look, you've got a power tool, so you just literally whack these trees down. I've got one ch hill cherry sapling. One. Yeah, but then you, you just plant it, cut it down, get the saplings off the next... You can just use grafters to get more saplings off it, and then you can oh. plant the whole orchard of hill cherries. I need bone meal or something then. There's bones around. I've got four of them. Ah. And I've got 11 bone meal. I'll stick it in this chest here. Um, if the server doesn't hey, lag it's too dark. badly. Ooh. It's night time, just if, in case you didn't know, because we've got night vision now. Yeah, so it's oh. night time, so watch out. I've put some candles around to so stop oh, yeah. quite so many mobs spawning. Just to set the mood. Do you have any jazz? Uh, this here is our <laughs> centrifuge. Um, Ugh. Oh, watch out. Somebody's trying to get fresh with you. He's detected the candles. I know. It's coming in. It's, it's, it's oh my God. I've got apple oak saplings and silver lime saplings. Time froze and he was like, oh yeah. That's right. Oh. So, so yeah, you'll have two types of, well, I don't know. You just have to, just have to grow all lots of crossbred trees, Simon. And then if you use the grafter on any crossbred tree leaf ever, um, as long as it's not a vanilla tree you will get a sapling straight away. And I've built lots of grafters, so we should have infinite sort of saplings, really. Let me see. So we use like a pump, a build craft pump. Oh, yeah. That's good. And then we'll need tanks. All right, so... Do we want to use portable tanks? Portable tanks? Yeah, because you can actually break those and, and they, they keep the liquid that's inside them. Oh, isn't there like a big new one there, like a, like a giant one? Uh, is there? I'm looking at tanks. Iron tank gauge, multi-block, variable size. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, yeah. Oh, that'd be amazing, actually. Yeah. Are they hard to make? Oh, we need iron plates. Oh, that's not... Oh, we need a rolling machine. Water tank siding. Iron tank wall. That's hard. This is hard to make. We need, like, loads of railcraft stuff, like rolling machines and shit. Oh, that's not hard. Rolling machine. That's easy. Rolling machine. Just need some crafting benches, some pistons. Okay, well we can no make props. some. We can, we, it's, it's it's a lot of work though, but we can we can make some rolling machines. Yeah, we let's get the structure built first. Yeah, yeah. Good, so good call. how big? I reckon. I haven't got any wood. Like three either side of this bit. Have you got any wood to make? Uh... I don't think we should be using wood. I oh, know. I mean, I mean to make a crafting bench. Oh. <laughs> I um, got... I've got one on this claw. Hang on, I'll let, I'll let you in my claw. Oh no no no! I've just I've just uh, chopped some wood, so I'll turn that, that into. Why is there wood on the side of a volcano? That's nuts. Oh, it's a it's a jungle, jungle tree. <laughs> yeah, why are they growing on the side of this actually? No, this isn't. This has stopped pouring. We need to get this going. Come on. Are we trying to set the? Are we actually trying to set the jungle on fire now? Well, no, it's it's got to look the part, isn't it? Yeah, uh, true, true. Yeah, that'll that'll do it. That that'll work. Sweet. Oh. Okay, let's use these chiseled stone bricks, and I reckon about there, and maybe one off, one off actually, a bit bigger. Three, so it would be like seven. Okay, two, three. Oh, lava! Okay. How do you make? Um, I'll, I'll see if I can make some basalt uh, brick. I think you just put like in the block, then you have four or something. Yeah. Okay, I'm coming back up to the top. Is that what? We, is that what we want to use? Basalt. I don't know. It's it's 
can you, what kind of steps can you make? Let me look up steps. Can you make basalt stairs? I don't think you can. No. Uh, oh, wait, wait, hang on. What's, oh, ebony. Ebony stairs. Oh, that's all those crazy woods, isn't it? Yeah. Can make uh, cobblestone stairs. I don't know. So this is the start of a giant tower, right? Are these the support struts? I'm just measuring it out. Um, all right. One, two, three, four. So we want to... Like here, and then we want to have it in the corners, don't we? I think that's a corner. So this will be one of the corners. Right. And as will there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this thing's going to be huge. Is this look big enough? It's pretty big, isn't it? Yeah, I think yeah. This, I think it's good though. Yeah, yeah. We could put like a put like a circle on top as well to make it look like a proper tower. The thing is, these tanks that we're building are, I think, they're squares. Oh, Maybe. where? Oh, oh! Ooh. I just saw an arrow. Well, actually, shoot past it might my be face. like any shape you want. I'm not sure. Oh, he's we'll have to try it out. There we go. Yeah, eat crap. Oh, creeper! Did you just get blown up? No, it was me. Don't worry. I was uh, shooting it with my my laser. Oh right. My, oh, laser. oh, the lava's One, almost reached two, the forest three, now. Four, I'm just gonna uh, dig this out. I want this whole forest ooh. to blaze. Oh yeah. <laughs> fire, fire doesn't spread that much anymore, though, does it? It no, doesn't like kind of go crazy. Not like it used to. No. Can't burn down an entire server anymore. Oh. <laughs> Happy days. <laughs>